Welcome back to my channel. Hello, my fellow weaves. Hi, I'm your humble hostess and follow Taco Neko. Welcome back to continuing opening up my May anime haul for 2021. Yes. Ah, but always, as always, I have to remind you this we gotta do it in parts. Uh, make it very short and sweet so you guys don't get overwhelmed or get bored from my own voice. Because I've been st stumbling my words lately. I don't know why. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoy this kind of videos. And I hope you guys actually leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe to this channel, and turn on the little bell to notify you for upcoming videos coming along. Because I've been doing a lot of thinking and like uh, trying to do like different kinds of content instead of like opening up hauls. Might as well do like some figmas and also nindoroids along with like certain uh, series if you guys want me to open up like a certain like uh, series that you like uh, you can just leave a comment either in my tiktok instagram or here on youtube if you like so <laughs> while you guys think about and ponder about the choices you want me to do let's go on with this video and let's start up opening up these babies come on let's go let's go let's start up with a little bit of ninderoid dolls if you guys actually don't know about this these are like little ninderoids but they're like dolls basically that you actually dress them up and like certain like accessories and everything dresses it depends on the characters you've been and i got a red riding hood and wolf theme for some reason just because like it has like little paws that comes with it and also the ears and the fluff fur it's just adorable and look at the back if you guys want to like, see what this actually includes and these are freaking adorable and i know when you go to like any uh anime uh stores back in japan over there they have like the certain like collection of outfits over there and also i know why is it so blurry and i know there's like some people like do it on like an etsy or anything like that that they do for you a custom made outfits for them as well and they're precious and everything and some of them i do recommend that you guys actually first check on the sellers and their reviews and everything because there are people who steal the, their designs and sell them a lot in wish and aliexpress which i really dislike so much i hate it i just want people to actually do like support the original artists or the makers of those outfits instead of like giving money to those people who rob their effort so you guys better do your research before buying anything let's go for the next now of course uh, school starts right now and whatnot how do you start the the year going back to school without buying more pencils i do have a lot of pencils i have a lot of collections of these i just like stationaries so you couldn't blame me for having like cute stationaries i have two types of these little pencils let's see the characters for each design this one with the original group that we have like Tanjiro Zenatsu, Inosuke, Gyo, Sanime. This is not the original one, but the Gyo. Ah, <laughs> uh, Gyo, mate. Why, why did I say Gyo? Well, he is there though. And this part we have little Tengen, also Gyo. Oh no, that's Moichiro. Oh my god, well, they look practically the same if there is no blue streak out of nowhere. And Mitsuri, because Mitsuri is love. And we got Obanai along with Shinobu and Niringoku. Yes, people, these babies will be in the store soon. So you better get these before they're gone. Because I have like uh, two each and one of them I'm gonna take for myself because why not stationary? Yay, let's go for another merch to open up. And of course, we always have to buy acrylic stands. Uh, you know, I, I am practically very obsessed about acrylic stands it's it's just so pretty to see like to see your favorite character standing here there and whatnot it does decorate the whole thing it just gives you more energy in the morning <laughs> to do something <laughs> to look at and of course we have gojo here and this is actually very specific for a an anime store back in japan is from animega and they only they're the only ones that actually they have this kind of style if you see this kind of style anywhere you see anywhere you anywhere you look you know that is from Animega. 
I got him along with Yuji because look at him with his little crepe. Oh my god, I really miss the crepes back in Japan. They do these a lot, especially when they go to like Tokyo Tower. They have the, such delicious crepes when I go there. There's like one also as well in Nikibukuro next to round, uh, round one. That one I like as well, because uh, but uh, because they always have like a certain like types of crepes that you like either from, either from nice either you want the uh, either salty, yes salty, to sweet, which is like a typical when you think about like crepes, but. Oh, but you can customize anything for your crepe. Like oh, usually when I'm like close to like lunchtime over there, I would like order for either like tuna mayo, which is like a go-to thing like in Japan, and it's delicious. And then nobody get mad because I like tuna mayo with sweet corn and like it just gives a good kick and a nice sweetness to the saltiness a little bit. And also I like to order like cheesecake and ice cream in my little crepe, cause it's delicious. Why not? Along with skate the infinity because why not let's skate a lot of a lot of you guys actually keep, keep asking about skate I have I do have a lot of skate items but it still take me a while until I go to those uh, this for those boxes unless 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 you guys leave a comment down below for me to like open up only that series. For you to do like a special haul for it to open up it would be better if you guys want so leave that comment down below either here on youtube or on instagram or in my tiktok hey the choice is yours and you can actually vote for what you want yep let's continue i do get these like little stands especially for like pairings that i like and please don't judge me and don't bash me in the comment because this is my choice and this is my, my my taste in men okay you don't get mad at it so of course i got adam which is ainosuke and i got tadashi because why not he, he's such a good boy and of course our little matcha blossom today because <laughs> who doesn't need like a more dosage of them and we have him with joe oh god i love joe so much and we always got little langa our little yeti Oh, he's so cute with Ricky. Uh, I love Ricky so much. He's just really precious. And actually, oddly enough, ordered a little stamp for him in the little dog outfit. It's just adorable. I might stamp him when I when you guys actually order from me, and I will just do like thank you notes for you guys. You might either get like a Hanako-kun or Ricky stamps in your little thank you notes. Yay. And also, I got the normal ones instead of the chibi ones. I got Joe in his little, <laughs> ah, little restaurant outfit because why not? He's so cute in this outfit. I love it so much. And I know it's okay. Because oddly enough, between me and my friend, my, <laughs> my friend Gin, I always actually snicker and laugh about like being looking like Bruce Wayne from Batman because the outfit and then like the alter ego and everything is just so fitting and so. Uh, it gives me life, okay? It gives me a source of energy for me. I need something to fuel me while I'm going on my day because sometimes you just need something to pick me up while you're doing stuff, adult stuff. <laughs> Let's go for the next item. I got little tiny stuff for myself and little stickers as well for those little stands you just, you just saw. I like collecting these for like resins, but, but I keep getting scared that I might uh, do like a mistake. But hopefully I don't do those mistakes. <laughs> but they're really cute for like a certain like project that I want to do for like a resin project. Oh, I haven't done resin for like a while now. And I got a little mini wow, mini clear file. I like collecting clear files. If you guys would see my collection, it's pretty big. And I do have like a bigger uh, clear file from Fate as well from one of the events. It's it won't fit in the screen but it's like this big it can cover up this whole table but i love it so much and i also got i know certainly enough we will not have to like uh, wear the uh, wear the mask anymore and everything like pretty soon but i still like these because I, I don't know for me especially when they get sick and everything i don't want people to get sick from me and be like the cause of reason for me to get uh, to be contagious to people to get sick. I thought this is redundant. 
but uh, yeah I got these in the glow in the dark so you just put like a little UV light on it and everything all oh, how much uh, you've been sitting outside the sunlight to hit this thing to recharge it to in order for it to just glow in the dark this is actually very helpful if you're like walking at night so people can see you from afar because sometimes there's places that are dark with no lights and I got for of course with Kuro for Nikoma and also I got Tsukushima <laughs> I guess I can shape my phone cross it though because why I like I like this ship. There's so many dojins that I like reading from because of these two. Ah, I do have them. Thank God I do have like some dojins. And hopefully I can find more when I go back to Japan and to either Mandarake, Toro no Ana, or La Shang Bang. I love these three places when I'm like uh Dojin hunting because usually when I just follow them, like the artists in like circles on Twitter. Whenever they're, they're releasing a doujin, I would just go from the low, the most closest place, Toronaana or La Shangbang or like any places that we go, nearest place I can buy for them because I need to fuel. These give me energy. <laughs> Let's go for the next. Schmickles, I cannot show you the whole thing because of the light, dang the ring light. But these, <laughs> I got this, a leisure sheet, uh, which is very odd for like a people who never use these when they're going out like for picnics or just uh, viewing or some uh, sightseeing or anything like that because usually when me and Gin go to Disney World or Disneyland basically in Tokyo D Disneyland and see they do have like parades lined up throughout the day and you need to sit on the ground to watch the parade sometimes you can if you're lucky enough to find any benches or like seats well they're not actual seats but you know like those uh little fences or like benches that out of stone that you can sit on but usually people just take uh reserve a space for them to sit on the ground in order for them to look at the parade while sitting instead of like standing up and just uh, um blocking everybody's view I'm short. I, I can cover up as well. Along with the, with Gin, we can enjoy the parade views. I do have like a couple of videos, but I still feel bad of not recording for Spooky Boo back in 2018. I still feel bad. But I got this one because in order for us to sit without worrying. But oddly enough, when I think about it, like we'll be sitting on their faces. That that register and let that sink in a little bit. <laughs> but I like these a lot. It's very useful. I might take it with me and for like our next trip because I, I just don't want to sit on those brochures. Oh my god, it hurts my butt. <laughs> but I, I do see these sometimes like in the arcades, of course, with different uh, anime titles as well. Uh, what's, what's the last time that I saw for this? Mm, I think for like a specific like Disney characters that I saw in the arcades. Along with Konosuba, I think I remembered. Uh, I'm not pretty sure because there are like a lot of items for these, and a lot of the Japanese people like to get these, especially for like Hanami uh, view, like for like the Sakura wa viewing or the Autumn Fall. Like they're basically the same uh, Autumn viewing as well, and they just sit and just watch the leaves change or anything, or like watch the Sakura petals flurry everywhere. It's very useful, at least. I, 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 at least my clothes will not get dirty or my pants. But uh, usually in Japan, is always the, the ground is always so clean. It's, it's the cleanest floor I've ever seen in my life. Uh, well, specific. I mean, what time of day? Because sometimes when they go to like Ikebukuro, they, 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 the park ain't so clean sometimes. Eh. But yeah, I got these. Let's go. <laughs> Yay. Sadly, I have to finish the video here and stop it here. And don't worry, we still have more stuff in the box. But next video is going to be all about plushies and dolls. Well, not specifically dolls, but, you know, anything that's souped and stuffy and that you can cuddle it. Yay. So, <laughs> thank you for, like, uh, well, waiting out all this, like, uh, lingering with me all this time with the video. Lingering, yeah. Not staying with me, but lingering. <laughs> anyway, anywho. Yes, thank you for staying all the way through the video. And I would like you guys to actually, if you guys like this video, hey, subscribe to this channel. Turn on the little bell to notify you upcoming videos in the future. 
Also, leave a like in the comment if you guys have any like uh, comments of uh, some series that you want me to unbox or talk about or anything. Just leave it down below and I will listen to it either here on YouTube, uh, Instagram, or TikTok. And I will leave all my little links down in the descri description box below if you guys are interested. And I see you guys in the next video with another content, either an Android reviews, anime, or anime haul unboxing, whichever you guys like, or eh, why not? We will enjoy anything that is all anime. And I see you guys in the next video. Bye!